This is Rockport Ryan with Texas Fishing Tips, and this is your weekly fishing report. All right, starting out this week. Uh, this weekend is looking absolutely beautiful. So if you've been holding off getting out there fishing, do not skip this weekend, unless you're going to be at the uh, Austin Boat Show. Uh, coming out here at the fish habitat, we've been having some awesome luck in the fish habitat. Generally, we've been starting out right on the edge, right between the road and those little islands, casting into those cuts and everything. With that, we've been throwing uh, unfair shrimp and some paddle tails. Then drift through there. Haven't been finding a whole lot in those islands themselves, but when you get along that back wall, that wall that just the, the back barrier of the fish habitat, doesn't matter which side of that shoreline you're on, come about five or six feet off that wall or off the shoreline. They're not right up against it. They're out a little bit right where it starts to drop off. With that, the Z-Man Trout Trick and Fried Chicken, that paddle tail has been really working well for us back in here, picking up both trout and redfish. All right, another place to take advantage of some of the weather that we've been having. You can actually launch from over here, marker 37, uh, coming all around that little flat area, right around those docks and everything. Been some uh, pretty decent flounder. Come around that point, there's a little cove right there. Uh, again, some picking up some nice flounder in there. In the deeper areas, we actually have been picking up some nice trout. Uh, if you want, you can paddle all the way back into these canals and right at some of these openings, we've been picking up some nice reds and some nice trout. Uh, another spot to check out is if you could launch from over here at Clems, uh, just head straight across onto these flats, right around these islands and everything, just off the edge of the channel. We've actually been picking up some nice reds, uh, upper slots, and uh, some good sized trout still running in here. And then if you feel like having some fun, just drop some dead shrimp off in that channel, hook into one of those big blacks and enjoy the ride. Another great place to run into with this nice weather coming up is gonna be launching from uh, anywhere along this road, coming out into Egri Flats. We have some nice water temperatures and it looks like it's gonna continue to rise. So definitely check out back in these areas in Egri Flats, or you can launch to the other side and hitting along into some of these marshes and along this shoreline uh, are still producing some nice reds. Uh, with that, we've mostly been throwing the Unfair Shrimp 85s. Uh, the pink has been working really well, as, long as, the, as well as the natural tan. Uh, also, when you come out a little deeper, if you come out around the bridge, uh, there we've been throwing the Rip and Slash in either red hot or hot orange. All right, if you're needing just a, a quick down and dirty trip to make a quick run, definitely come out either airport to Murph Park, Murph Park to airport, anywhere along there. Go out a little bit further. Uh, you might encounter some of the waders. They're not coming up way up on the shore, but we are catching some that are out a little bit further. I've uh, been picking up some nice trout. Reds have been kind of scattered, but the trout definitely have been out there, and that's been uh, all on paddle tails. We got another wild card coming at you this week. Uh, strangely enough, we have actually were going for a recreational paddle into Little Bay and could not believe the number of reds that we were seeing. Uh, coming along the uh, Fulton Beach Road, along that shoreline, and then definitely up between those islands. We were seeing tons of red and wishing we had our poles with us. But the, uh, if you've got a chance and you're in Rockport, quick, just run out there. You can launch from any, pretty much anywhere along the road or even from the beach park. Very little boat traffic and a whole lot of fish activity right now. This is Rockport Ryan. Thank you for watching.